The Iranians say that within 10 days they will surpass that uranium enrichment limit laid out in the Iran nuclear deal. That, according to the country's atomic energy uh, organization spokesperson. Now, speaking today at Iran's Auric heavy water facility, the spokesman added that Iran could start enriching uranium at 20 percent, bringing the enrichment level steps away from weapons grade material. Under the current JCPOA nuclear deal that was established in 2015, Iran cannot surpass an enrichment level of 3.67 percent. After the United States pulled out of the deal last year, Iran has faced extreme economic pressure amid renewed sanctions by the Americans. In an effort to continue pressure on the international community to renegotiate the deal, the Atomic Energy Organization spokesman threatened more uranium enrichment and increased heavy water stockpiles if European countries failed to meet Tehran's demands in the next two months. With another set of actions, if after 60 days they will not uh, implement their commitments. Those comments come amid heightened tension in the region after Iran and Iranian proxies have been blamed for a series of attacks on Western oil infrastructure over the past few weeks. Now, last week, two oil tankers were targeted with limpet mines near the Persian Gulf. The United States, Saudi Arabia, and Israel have all blamed Iran, but provided limited evidence. The U.S. military did release a video that allegedly shows an Iranian gunboat approaching one of the damaged tankers to remove an unexploded mine. Now, today in Brussels, at a meeting of a number of foreign EU ministers, they discussed this issue of Iran. And countries such as Germany said they are going to wait until more information is out before they point the finger at who is responsible for last week's attacks. Julie? Trey Yanks, thank you very much.